This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Okay, so let's uh, let's talk about Caesar Pina. He's missing uh, because he's avoiding process servers. The many people are trying to serve him with suits, uh, take him to court for different things he's done uh, regarding real estate scams, allegedly, because he's not guilty yet. But uh, it's funny, they're not serving DJ Envy, though. DJ Envy is c supposedly cooperating against Caesar Pino, but he'll get arrested himself if he doesn't actually cooperate. This is a disgusting scam that happened in, you know, DJ Envy is very guilty in this. You know, he, this guy, Cesar Pino, wouldn't have been able to take this many people down if it wasn't for Envy and his influence, you know. But um, anyways, we'll see what happens with that. Now, BG's doubling down on the whole snitch thing, says he has a movie coming out talking about kill all snitches. But this is only... Uh, this is a, a, for some reason he got a snitch chain now, and now he's he's doing a movie about snitches when he was just accused of being a snitch. Now I don't think he's a snitch, but it's it's a weird response. I wrote a movie while I was locked up too. You heard me? You know what I'm saying? We're doing a motherfucking movie called Snitch Busters. You heard me? You know what I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna take the theme from the Ghostbusters. You know what I'm saying? Gonna have a big old rat, like they had the big old marshmallow man. You know what I'm saying? Gonna have the big old rat, and I'm gonna be hunting. You know what I'm saying? The 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 the, the ghost of these motherfuckers. <laughs> Let me stop playing, man. But nah, the movie definitely coming soon, man. Hey, I wrote a movie. Yeah, I'm gonna tell you something. Uh, he's he's going so hard with this now that it's almost like I'm starting to think like, did he snitch on somebody? Is there something else out there that he's feeling guilty about? Because he's going a little hard with this now. It's like if he had just whoa. I wasn't ready for that picture. Look at T.I. was filming himself earlier. I, got, I have to switch the subject because that was that was too crazy. T.I. was filming himself earlier. And he's like, and he pans the phone over to his wife. What the? What? Bro. Nah. Ain't no way. I, I can't even say anything. It's just too crazy. Nah. Mm-mm. The game loses a second lawsuit to that girl that sued him from VH1. The game loses second lawsuit. I guess this is for him, like, hiding money and stuff. Uh, let's do, see the details on this. And the second lawsuit against the game, Priscilla Rainey, a former contestant in 2015, she got game. She sued him for assault. She got $7.1 million, right? And then... She also uh, talked about there's shell companies to avoid, you know, complying. He's hiding assets um, and he must fully cooperate. Right. So then Rainey uh, alleged that he gave up his role as manager of the company and passed the torch to his manager, WAC 100. So then Rainey seeks to seize eventually and ask the court to delegitimize these shell companies so she could access the owed funds. <laughs> so basically, on December 13th, they discussed this. And the music executive and provocator told the authorities that his client gave him Los Angeles house due to a personal debt between them. So WAC 100 owns Game's house. Basically owns Game. And nothing more. And let's see. So meanwhile, let me think of the debacle. Let's see. So I'm assuming in this suit, let's see. They're not very clear about this. Uh, reporting one second lawsuit against her. This time, she accused him of attempting to hide the wealth. So I guess winning means that they're going to look further into this. Because I don't see... The, 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 there's no, like, resolution yet. But... If WAC 100 was complicit, WAC 100 is going to go down for fraud. 
as well. So that's not going to be good. Anyways, this is Jordan Tao with JT News. I'll check you guys in the next one. Peace.